by Tony Barra update on the LAPD car running over the woman in the sand and the Los Angeles Fire Department getting educated in the U.S. Constitution and First Amendment. It worked out for all. Here's a video. This incident and says that she plans to file a lawsuit against the LAPD. In a social media post, O'Skigan says she was sleeping and woke up under the front bumper of a squad car. She says it was absolutely terrifying. She says at one point she was stuck under the wheel of the car and couldn't move. She says her back still hurts and continues to make cracking sounds. She doesn't understand how this could happen. She says she was in a bright bathing suit on a rainbow-colored towel. Several people witnessed the incident. Uh, ladies uh, laying down on the beach and then the cop car just ran her over. Bust her over. Yeah, I guess they just weren't looking. Acquaintances tell us O'Skiggins was taken to the hospital and has since been released. O'Skiggins also calls into question whether cops should be allowed to drive on the beach. The LAPD says it's their duty to patrol the beach to cut down on drugs, theft, and other crimes that occur on Venice Beach. She also praised a man who continued to record the incident despite a paramedic trying to stop him. No, you need to better step back. The cops informed the paramedics it was okay for the new stringer to record. I don't want him to get fired because he probably has a family and all that. I want him, I want him to get proper training when it comes to uh, the First Amendment, freedom of the press. Yes, and uh, the LA City Fire Department tells us that the incident was handled administratively, and they also tell us that firefighters were reminded of the issues surrounding this incident. Now, as for the officer that was involved in this collision, LAPD officials say that a traffic report was taken by the West Traffic Division, and they also say that the officer involved remains on full duty here in Venice. We're now reporting live in Venice, Mary Beth McDade, we'll send it back to you guys in the studio. Back okay? Are you holding up? Are you okay? Hey, you might want to shut that off, please. First Amendment right. No, you don't. This is privacy. You need to shut that off, sir. You better step back. No, you need to You better step back. All right. You better step back. Officers! Officer! Officer! You better step back. You have this guy get, get him out of here. You better step back. This is I, privacy. I will, you cannot be doing First this. First Amendment right, my friend. No, you don't. Have, First Amendment right. First Amendment right. I will sue the hell out of you all. It's just for medical. I understand that. This is a big story, though. You better, you better, you better learn your law, dude. You need to move. You better. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. What are you gonna do about it? I'm acting on my First Amendment right. What are you gonna? I'm media. I'm media. I'm media. No, you're not. Don't tell me. I ain't gotta show you shit. I ain't gotta show you a motherfucking thing. I will sue the shit out of you, man. Are yeah. you kidding me? I'm, I'm acting on my First Amendment oh, right, man. Fine, pop it, man. You want to play with me? Okay. All right, we're cool. All right. I'm, not, I'm shooting my small camera right now, but I don't I have a press pass, but I don't have to show it. Okay. Civil Division, I, I like these guys because they know the law, but you get a lot of like firemen that don't know the law, but I've always got along with the Civil Division. Because they know the Constitution. You want to see my press pass? I don't have to show my press pass. Okay, thank you, officer. All right. All right.